What's up guys? So I wanted to show you how I made the not nice beads. So basically, what I started out with was this key sound. Just some synth keys. So these are the chords that I laid down, just like this. I immediately heard the exact 808 pattern that I would want on it in my head. So what I actually ended up doing is creating this 808 in Massive. Um, a lot of people like to use samples for their 808s and there's nothing wrong with that. I do that all the time too. But I am kind of proud of myself for actually just making this sound from scratch. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to get into the technical details of that. but. That's my 808. I do have it layered with uh, some overdrive. I have it layered with some EQ. And of course, uh, some compression up on that. Um, every sound that you're hearing though is not, is not completely mixed. It's not, in, it's not what it sounds like in its final form because after I finish this beat, I do go to a studio, I record, we mix it down, we get it sounding nice and polished. So. Um, on top of this 808 sound, we do have more effects plugged into it that are just pushing it and driving it even harder. And same for all the sounds that you're hearing here. And I had an idea to go ahead and layer it with this harp sound. It's one of those things where it's just a little bit of ear candy. And so my beat was coming together and I knew for the hook I wanted to go ahead and build it up. So I took this other synth sound. So I chose the sound and I played a little rhythm right above it and it's just complementing those chords that I already laid down. And I copied this sound, this synth that I'm playing for you, and I basically did the exact same thing except one octave higher just to fill it out more, make it more exciting, more interesting. And that sounds like this. And it's a lot quieter than the other one, just to uh, not overpower anything. And then from there, I basically just started building up my drums. So uh, I started my clap, which is generally what I start with when I'm trying to build up my percussion. So we got that here. And then I threw in my kick. Yeah, so then I started building up some, my hi-hat rhythm. So I had... And I layered that hi-hat with a second hi-hat. Kind of gives it more, a little bit more bounce to it kind of goes back, it feels like it's going back and forth to me. So I added a little hi-hat roll here. And then I added an open hi-hat. My drums and my 808. And by then, I pretty much had the beat, because here's everything together. So from there, there was one last sound I added. Basically this last sound that I added is just a vocal chop, uh, just processed differently. Um, it's just kind of the tail end of it. I liked this little, this little sound here and I just threw it in and here it is soloed out. It's just a nice little sample. A nice little sound to just keep it interesting. And that's it. That's the not nice beat. Just like that. The way I make moves.
lose, it's not nice Shit I wanna prove, it's not nice Everyday mood, it's not nice It's really all true, I don't mean to be rude Never can lose, it's not nice My attitude, it's not nice Style all new, it's not nice It's really all true, Hey.